Normally, when we use Google Maps, we are receiving directions and traffic updates. What if I told you that you could do so much more, like for example, how to measure exact distances and surface areas? Hello there, my name is Dominic and today I'm going to show you exactly that. Now first we are going to measure the exact distance between the Nairobi Central Railway Station up to the Kencom Ambassador. This is a bus stage. So how do you go about doing that? Now let's say for example that I have just alighted a train and I want to measure the distance that it will take me to walk from the Nairobi Railway Station to the Kencom Ambassador. Maybe for example I want to take a bus to another area. So how do I calculate this distance? So this is how you do it. You right click on the maps then you select measure distance and you see a dot will appear. Now when this dot appears you are just going to click on your walking path. I'm just going to do like this. Maybe I'll come here then cross the road to the August 7th Memorial Park. Then I walk all the way to here. I take this diversion then walk up to Kencom House. Like this. Now if you make a mistake you can just drag this like that. And like that. You can see I have already mapped out my route like this. Now from the Nairobi Central Railway Station up to Kencom Bus Park it is 809. 0.62 meters. To exit, you just click on the cancel sign over here, like that. Well, how useful is this method? Well, if you know the mileage of your vehicle, you can actually calculate the amount of fuel that you are going to use for a journey if you are going to map out a longer journey. You can even use this to plan your routes appropriately. The next thing that I'm going to teach you is to calculate the area. Now, for example, I want to calculate how much area the Nyayo National Stadium actually takes up. And for that, I'm just going to select a point, then I right click, then I select measure distance, then I'm going to map out the perimeter of the Nyayo National Stadium like this. From here to here, it's actually a straight line like that. I just map it out like this. And at the end, you are going to join it to the starting point like that. The Nyayo National Stadium takes up a total area of 95,983 meters squared. And the total perimeter is around 1.67 kilometers. And you can see the advantage that you also have imperial measurements over here. If you are into that, this is like a million square feet and 1.04 miles in perimeter. So that is how you calculate the area. So how does this benefit you as a regular user? Well, I'm going to teach you. Now, for example, we can measure the amount of iron sheets that we are going to use to replace in this building. You just right click on the edge of the building, select measure distance, then you map out the roof area like that. Now, if you give these measurements to your contractor or your roofing company, they will know exactly how many iron sheets they are going to use to replace the roof of this building. So that's how beneficial it is to know these two methods of calculating the distance and calculating the area. And again, if you're into measuring things using the imperial system, you can see that we even have the square feet. And that's it. I hope you learned something new today. I think I'm going to do a follow-up to the video to this one, showing you the other things that you could do with Google Maps. Thank you for watching. Let's meet in the next video and goodbye.